of the strutting legs have a trick or common sequence behind it. And I'm going to share those tricks and sequences with you one by one. So, ready to learn today's trick behind this aggressive sounding lick? Well, without wasting any further time, let's get started. Hey everyone, I'm Honeybee and welcome to my channel. Now, if you are new here, this video is from an ongoing series. I'd suggest you to take some time and start from the very beginning of this series. Else you may not understand some references that I might use here from my previous videos. The playlist link is in the description. Now, this lick that I'm playing is in A minor and actually consists of an exercise. But you can also use this in your guitar solos to have a shredding effect. Exercise that you can use in your guitar solos. That's a win-win, right? Let's see what it is. So this is the tab for the lick that I'm playing. You can take a snapshot if you wish. Now the beginning of the lick is the main part that we'll be focusing on. Since we're in A minor, we will start with the A minor scale pattern or the A Aeolian mode pattern, which means Aeolian mode pattern that starts with this note A. Now, just for clarification, the Aeolian and minor scale are similar. Refer to the sixth practice pattern that I've shared previously if you don't remember the pattern for Aeolian mode. Also here by minor, I mean natural minor. Now, don't worry if you don't know what natural minor is. Slowly, we will cover everything about scales and modes in this series. Now, what we're doing is playing the minor or Aeolian pattern in a particular sequence. <coughs> playing three notes per string. The first three notes on the sixth string. And then the next three notes on the fifth string. Now again, repeat these three notes on the fifth string. And move to the fourth string and play the next three notes. Again, repeat this and move to the third string. Play the next three notes. Again, repeat this. Move to the second string and play the next three notes. And done. This was the main shredding trick sequence. See how the repetitions made the simple scale pattern sound aggressive, very simple, yet very very effective. Now rest of the piece is easy and you should be able to play it with the help of the taps. Now those who have been following this shredding series from the beginning, try applying this repetition sequence in those practice patterns that I've shown you previously in this series. When you practice them, add this exercise to your guitar practice routine and let me know the results. I'll be more than happy to see you progress. One more thing as I say in most of my videos, while watching this video, take your guitar and sit with it. Try this practically with me, in this way you will learn faster. Now practice as well and shred. So that was it for today's video. If you found this video helpful, do like, subscribe and share it with your fellow guitar enthusiasts. See you next week. Keep shredding.